What it is and what it ain't, YouTube. This is your boy B. Back again to do another video. Um, first of all, let me apologize for not doing a video in about a week. Um, I've just been trying to get some stuff together, but I know that's not an excuse. Uh, second thing is, um, I got this camera right here, this new camera, so I'm trying to do it with this instead of doing it on my laptop right here. So, I need to focus on the lens instead of focusing on the little monitor right here. Okay, so, get that setting straight. Anyway, what I'm going to talk about is just me going off, ranting and bitching about something that I'm pretty sure we've all been through and hate. And I'm not going to tell you. Let me break down the story first before I tell you what I'm going to go into. I'm at QT at 4 o'clock in the morning. Don't ask me why I'm at QT at 4 o'clock in the morning. I just am. Trying to get me something to drink and something to snack on, right? So, you know, I do come out with a little 49 cent cup and everything. And as I'm walking back to my car, there's a motherfucker standing right in front of my car. Here we go with some bullshit. Hey, Amen. You got a dollar? Yes, the infamous, infamous question. Do you have a fucking dollar? Which I did. But you know what? I didn't give it to his ass. You best believe that you are not getting my money out of my fucking wallet that I worked so hard for. So, you know, I'm like, no, I don't have a dollar. As I'm getting into my car. And, you know, they can never accept no for an answer. It's always some other bullshit. They got to tell you. And this motherfucker starts telling me his story and shit. Hey, yo. Uh, well, see, I just got out of Fulton County Jail, and, you know, and my ride dropped me off here. And, you know, I'm just trying to get a dollar so I can catch the bus back and all this kind of shit. I don't give a fuck. I got my own problems to deal with. You think I give a shit about you being dropped off somewhere you don't belong? And, see, the real thing is the motherfucker was lying, all right? And, frankly, I always... Uh, I always believed in the line anyway, but it took a, just a second for me to break down this story after I had drove off. You in Fulton County Jail. What the fuck are you doing in Mableton at 4 o'clock in the morning? Then, okay, you want to catch the bus. The bus to where? Anybody that knows the Atlanta area and knows our bus system and everything, Mableton is as far as you can fucking go on the bus system west. Where the hell, where you gonna go? A mile up the street? So, I mean, if you're trying to catch the bus to go even more west, you clearly ain't getting no dollar from me just to go up a mile up the fucking street. Then, if you're trying to go back east to Atlanta, then why don't you have the motherfuckers who drove your ass here drop you off Somewhere between here and there so you won't be here asking me for my fucking money. And uh, you know what the problem is? It's always a motherfucker who don't look like they starving too much. Who's coming up to you asking you for a damn dollar. I mean, you, you don't look like you missed too many fucking meals. Now, I'm not this mean. If it's a homeless person or somebody that's really struggling, I might help them out a little bit. But I can distinguish between if your ass is starving or not. Alright. Don't come up to me ask me if I got a fucking dollar. Damn. Get it together. Shit. Get your ass. You, you know what? Matter of fact, here's the game plan for everybody who needs a fucking dollar. Take your ass down to the missionary, the church, wherever, the homeless shelter. Ask them to give your ass a fucking bed in a fucking job application, you know, work the job for two weeks, get a paycheck, get the hell on, move into a hotel if you had to, all of that. But you're not getting my fucking dollar out of my money, all right? And that's real. Matter of fact, I'm going to start doing the, the real bullshit. As soon as you walk up to me, I'm going to ask you if you got a dollar. And we're just going to be standing there asking each other if we got a dollar. And that's going to be it. Because you ain't getting no money from me. And you never will. Alright y'all. That's pretty much it for today. Um, now see. Since I got this camera. I can start doing stuff outside like I wanted to. Instead of being. Doing stuff in my apartment. 
you know. And hopefully that's going to pop off soon. Hopefully it's going to pop off Saturday. Because I got plans on Saturday that I want y'all to be a part of. So stay tuned for that. And all of that. And that's pretty much it. Now this it would be better, so much better if they had a remote control for this camera. And so I want to have to get up and do this.